Hi, this is my 10 minute core workout I call espresso abs. All you're gonna need for this workout is a mat and your body. Let's get started. Extend your legs, keep your knees soft, flex your feet, arms out, roll down for four. Roll all the way down, each vertebrae hits. Roll up and extend your arms up to the ceiling. Do that again, slow down, four, three, two, one. Roll up, extend those arms up, down, nice and easy. Keep your knees soft and your heels flexed. Reach in a neutral spine. Roll down. I want you to reach up to practice some really good posture. Inhale, down. Exhale, up. Down, two, four, three, two, up. Two more. Reach up. Last time, all the way down. Bring your arms up to center. Okay, we're going again. Roll down, but we're gonna add a little rotation. Roll up, rotate, front arm, down for four, three. Now switch your side, so roll up, drop that back arm and reach back. Great, down, two. How you doing? Come on, pull up and rotate. Yeah, do that again. Down for four, three, two. Roll up and rotate. Excellent. Come back to center, roll all the way down. You get to rest a little bit. Okay, bring those knees up. Breathe. Hands back behind your head. Hold there. And just extend and bend your legs. Bring them up and down. I'm giving you a second to rest. Good, keep going. Give me four more there. Four, then we'll add those abdominals. Three. Last two. So from here, keep the legs extending. Lift hips and shoulders up and down. Lift those hips and shoulders. Pull the legs up. As your legs reach for the ceiling, lift. Breathe. Four more. Keep those elbows back. No pulling on the neck. That is not an option. Last two. One more. Great. Rest. Tuck those legs in. And release your feet down to the ground. Take your hands back behind your head. Okay, so we're gonna do an oblique crunch with an alternating knee lift. Let's try it. Come to me first, go up and down. Great, stay with this. Okay, as you come across, keep that elbow back. Bring the shoulder across and rotate. Exhale, inhale. Give me four more, then the front leg is gonna stay up and we're gonna keep pumping, two. Okay, front leg remains up and keep coming across. Shoulder to the knee, great. Keep going. Four more there. Three. Now your base leg is gonna come up. Knee to knee, keep rotating. Okay, you got four more for me, not done yet. Gonna make it a little bit harder. Come on, you want those abs, you have to work for them. So now reverse curl with that twist. Hips come up, pull your belly to button to your spine and squeeze. Great, keep going. I know you can do this. Do not quit. Give me four more. Four, then I'll give you a rest. Three, last two, one more. Oh, yes, good, rest. Pull those knees in, drop your feet, take your hands back behind your head. Now start to the back with those oblique crunches. Here we go, lift the knee, keep going, squeeze across. Eight more for me. Seven, excellent. Six, okay, so not only are you working your sides, you're working your whole rectus abdominis. Come on, last two. Back leg is gonna stay lifted and keep twisting. Just a reminder, shoulder comes across, not the elbow. Four more there. So without pulling on your neck, rotate. Two more. Lift your base leg, keep crunching to the side. Up, down. Breathing, that's really important. <laughs> if you don't breathe, you're gonna pass out on me, so go four more. Three, let's go. Okay, last reverse curl for eight. Lift those hips, try not to kick. Seven, that's not an option. Six, use your abs, get your hips up. Last four, come on, drive. 
twist, hips up, two, one more, oh yes, good, excellent, rest, okay, I felt that one, okay, drop your feet and take your hands back behind your head, extend your legs for one second and rest, deep breath, exhale, bend your knees again, okay, feet start up and we're going to go into a bicycle with your front leg kicking, here we go, kick, now lift your shoulders, add rotation, come across. Great, keep going. Getting stronger as we go along. Now kick three, hold one. So we go one, two, hold. Do that again. Now only bring the leg as close to the ground as your back can handle. Three, two, so keep your belly button to your spine. Go three, two, two more for me. Here we go. Three, two, one more, and three, two, hold. Yes, bring those knees in and rest. Okay, I'm gonna give you a little stretch. Drop your feet. Now bring your arms all the way up overhead and extend your arms. Take a nice deep breath, let your rib cage expand. Exhale, bring your arms back into your head, bend your knees. Bring your feet up and we're gonna set for another set of bicycle. Kick that front leg, here we go. Kick, lift your shoulders, rotate across. Okay. So we're gonna do that whole thing again, but we're gonna add on to it. So kick three, reach. So go three, two, extend. Now reach for your shoelace across. Up, down, up. Try that again, come on, rotate. Three, two, hold, reach. Shoelace, come around. Come on, reach. Do that again, kick. Three, two, hold, reach. Now. You're gonna twist to the same side that you're reaching to again. Two more. Kick. Hold, ready to reach? Come on. You can do this one more time, everybody. Three, two, hold, reach, last one. Oh my goodness. Rest, pull those knees in. Okay, we're gonna kick, roll up. Turn around, set up for a plank. Roll all the way down to the ground. Lift your feet. Okay, going into a push-up. Here we go. Lift, tuck your toes down, extend your knees, hold, bend your knees, feet up, and slow down. Now, this is lots of core, so press. Keep your belly button to your spine. Nice straight body, down, feet up, slow down. Again, up, feet down, full plank. Excellent. Down, feet up, slow, slow on your way down. One more time. Lift, feet down, extend. Hold, knees down, feet up, and slow. Excellent job, rest there. Stretch those legs down to the ground. Pull your elbows under, bring your body up, hold that stretch. Little modified cobra, hold here, that feels great. You guys did a great job. Now, one important part that I know for a very strong core is to have the flexibility component also. So stay here and stretch. Roll down, put the hand on top of the chin. Chin on top of the hand, reach around and grab your foot, pull it back. So another very important component to having a healthy core is to have good flexibility. Switch those legs. So let's take this time and just stretch out those muscles that we worked. Those hip flexors worked really hard, so pull that heel back and hold that stretch. Drop that foot, take your hands in underneath your shoulders, push up to all fours and sit back into child's pose. Couple of deep breaths there. Slowly roll your body up and swing your legs around. Have a seat. And let's stretch those hamstrings. Inhale. Exhale. Reach towards your feet and hold that stretch. Slowly roll up. Bring your right knee up and cross it over. Wrap those arms and twist. Look back towards your shoulders and hold that stretch. Come back to the center, release that leg. Inhale again. Exhale, reach forward. Hold that hamstring stretch. Try to get a little lower this time. Slowly roll it up. Bring your left knee up and around. Wrap your arm and twist. Open the chest, look back over your shoulder, hold that stretch. 
come back to the center, bend your knees. Wrap those hands underneath your thighs, slowly roll back. Chin to your chest and sit tall. Great, one more time, all the way down. And roll up. Excellent job, that's it for this segment of Star Trainers. If you have more energy to burn, check out more programs on Exercise TV. Great job, you guys.